I'm Lily. A year and a half ago, a year, three months ago, something like that, I came out um, as transgender. And, you know, so it's been a kind of a roller coaster. And I think, I think I'm, I'm making a video now just to reflect on, you know, me being transgender. Um, brief stuff on what transgender or trans is. Um, transgender is kind of this definition. The definition of it is, um, you know, if you challenge um, your born sex, like if your gender identity, which is on the inside, it's the person you are, doesn't match the sex that you're given when you are born or you don't match society's standards of your gender role, your gender role being what mainstream society thinks you should be doing in your gender. It's really weird society gets to comment on shit like that. But yeah, if you don't match that up, you're probably transgender. And a lot of things come under being transgender. Like, um, uh, let's see, inter... Um, well, no, uh, gender fluid. Let's say you're gender fluid. You like you swing between genders, or if you're like bi gender, you bounce back and forth between the two binary genders. Or if you are a transvestite, you dress up as a boy or a girl, or what typically boys and girls wear. So if you wear what the opposite sex wears, like in that kind of way, you're a transvestite. So you're trans too. Uh, if you're a drag king or drag queen, you're also trans. Funny enough, even though it's a performance thing, you are still challenging your gender roles in society, which is awesome. Um, you know, you have um, you have Hydra, which is a transgender. Uh, you have Two Spirit, which is a transgender, um, and a, a couple of other things. You know, like uh, cross dressing is a transgender. So, you know, I'm not telling you what you are if you identify as any of these things and you don't think you're transgender. That's fine. That's cool. But I mean, like. From my understanding, I think, you know, from my study of, of it all, that's what it is. So I'm transgender, and there's a huge broad scale. I mean, like, there's the two binary genders. There's male and female. And there's also intersex people, but um, I'm not... I don't really know enough about that topic to really speak about it. So I'm just going to talk about the two binary genders and the gender spectrum, I guess. So there's male and female, the two binary genders, and those two genders are on each end of the spectrum called the gender spectrum. I call it. Um, and in, in between all of those are all the other genders and either side of them as well. You never know. There's genders that could be totally off the fucking rails, you know? So, and on that spectrum, I identify as a male to female trans person in that I am going to transition from being a binary male gender over this spectrum until I'm happy with where I am. Now, the spectrum doesn't, like, go from male, kind of male, a little bit less male, oh, totally neutral, kind of female, really female, super female. It's not like that. It's just, like, there's a load of things in between the two genders that you can be. And I identify as a male to female trans person or a transsexual, I guess, I would go, I'm going to be called because I'm going through a gender transition and I came out and started my gender transition a year and three months ago, two months ago, something like that. No, a year and four. A year and four months ago, I came out and I told my friends, my family, uh, my lecturers in college uh, that I'm transgender and I don't want to be called my old name anymore. And I don't want to be called he anymore because that's really pissing me off. And a lot of people came around and they were great about it. And that's awesome. And throughout that year and a half, I've been, you know dealing with the fact that my gender doesn't match and I've been actually dealing in it with it in productive ways I mean I've been doing things I've been going through my transition now a lot of people think that transition is kind of like you know um going through the physical changes vis-a-vis -vis like hormones and operations surgeries laser hair removal all that kind of crack and that's not actually what a transition technically means i mean we transition every day in our life if something changes everybody is in the middle of a transition somewhere you're moving out of your house that's a transition dude you're you're getting married that's a total transition you're you're buying a car that's a transition you're making coffee you're transitioning from being asleep to being awake okay it's a transition everyone transitions it just means change and i've been going through a transition a big one and my big one has been my social transition and a social transition is where you, you come out and you tell people that you 
are not the gender they perceive you to be. And that's what I did. And throughout my social transition, which has ba basically ended a couple of months ago, really, is that everybody started coming around and seeing me as the gender I want to be referred to as, which is female, because I am female. Hopefully you guys are still with me on this. Um, so, you know, I... <sighs> Making videos is hard, okay? It's hard. Um, so I'm pre-hormonal treatment. I've been diagnosed with gender dysphoria, you know, and my diagnosis has been confirmed. And that's a really long process. It takes a long time. So I'm starting my physical transition soon, which is awesome for me. It's making me really happy because, I mean, with my social transition slowing down to a halt because everybody came around and everyone's accepted me for who I am. It kind of actually left me in a void in that, wow, everybody gets that I'm a girl, but I'm still not a girl. Ah, I am on the inside, just not on the outside. It doesn't, it doesn't flourish. I'm not the beautiful flower that I wish I am or whatever. So I'm going for hormone replacement therapy pretty soon. I don't have a date yet, but I know it's pretty fucking soon. So that's going to happen. And um, the road so far has just been crazy. And I just said, you know, I'd make a video to talk about it. And I just did. I did this thing. I came out. I took a really big step and I've sacrificed a lot of things in my life. I've put a lot of things on the back burner that probably shouldn't have gone there. But I did. Because this was the most important thing in the world to me. And it still is. So this is going to be the first of many, I guess, videos throughout what's going to be happening and the big changes in my life that are coming around in the next couple of months, couple of years. And I just thought, you know, let's make it. Let's talk about it. So here I am. Um, don't expect anyone to actually even watch or like this video anyway. But it's here. So. There you go.